Is this the hey. kind one? Hey. Yeah, no, this is the aggressive one, aren't you? Hello, I'm just sorting out. Do you remember Philippe's mother uh, gifted me three beautiful collages? She is so clever. In fact, I am going to leave the link to her artwork below because she'll create a collage for you using everything um, that's in your life. So these are all based on my life with my love of animals and Marylebone and everything. Anyway, there, I've, just um, I've just got them back from the framers and he's framed them beautifully. Have a look. Absolutely beautiful. And I'm just deciding where I'm going to put them in the flat because I have hardly any space. And I did want to talk to you. I'll put this here for the time being. Um, I wanted to talk to you about moving back into the flat. All of you, without exception, last week, in fact, last week's video did extremely well. And without exception, you all said you prefer this flat to the one upstairs. And I understand why. It is lighter, it appears bigger, but it's all smoking, literally smoking mirrors. It's because I have mirrors everywhere. It is the same size as the one upstairs. Um, one of you, and I can't remember, forgive me who it was, one of you said in the comments, yes, you miss the Peter Pan view. That's what that view was like. It was Peter Pan, the rooftops of London, whereas now it's the rear windows of people's apartments and the restaurant below. But I'm getting used to it. I am looking at other places, and um, so I may only be here briefly before I rent somewhere else. But probably, if you are watching this in London, you'll know that certainly in the centre of London, things are taking a long time to get back. To how they were and um, in fact all of London is a bit tricky um, but it does mean there's loads of places to choose from if you want to rent so I've been looking at lots of places but I'm back here Matilda's back on her chair where she always was happy um, I do love the light in this flat um, and I actually have enjoyed being back here I really have enjoyed being back here um, but let's see what I'm gonna do so um, this week I have had three days off. I'm on the last day of my three-day holiday because I was meant to be in Mallorca with my friend Frankie. And obviously because of quarantine, I couldn't go. So I've just hung around London. Um, I am going to the seaside, which will be good. Um, but otherwise, I'm just hanging around London and, and sorting stuff out here, really. And um, it's all a bit bitty, uh, the blog this week. It is a bit bitty, but I quite like it like that. What else have I got to tell you about my life? What's happening in my life? What's happening in my job? Well, I'm still there five days a week. Um, we're a skeleton team at the BBC. Um, the show is from 1.30 to 5. Uh, the podcast is in its later series. We aren't recording anymore at the moment, so we're on a break. But Dobson City, the podcast, had rave reviews, is doing very well. Check it out. That's all the announcements. Now let's get on. I'm gonna I'm gonna put these pictures up myself. Um, I can hang pictures. About that's about the only DIY I can do. This is Marylebone Art Shop and this is uh, Mike who lent me the hammer to put my pictures up. You were right, I should have used the spirit level but I've just carried on. Oh no, that's cool. Is, I'm quite well known around this area but I'm nowhere near as well known as Mike. Um, and this gallery has been here for so many years but look at this. Oh Who's my this? goodness. She is so, is this the hey. kind one? Hey. Yeah, no, this is the aggressive one, aren't you? 
Look at the colour of the eyes. Lots of you who are, um, are old Marylebone people, well, people who've lived here a long time, you'll remember Mike had this very famous dog, Rufus. Yes. Pyrenean right. mountain dog. That's right, gone a few years now. Yeah, though. but everyone knew him. When the BBC was over the road, we all used to know this gallery because it was with the dog. dog. Now he's got these beautiful, they came here as kittens. They came here to catch the mice. They came to catch, are they catching mice? We have no mice now. Oh, so they've worked. They've worked, we have no mice at all. And what have you got exhibiting at the moment? We have that Sarah Pye, is nice. Which is the Sarah Pye, the tree? That one there, yeah. She's quite famous, isn't mm. she? She's very well Look known. Look at these. So all of these are in this gallery. And many of you, because I live next door, many people come by at night when it's closed. You need to come here during the day, otherwise it's very frustrating. That's a Sarah Wassett yeah. mm. as well. It was beautiful, very, very beautiful. I think she might have been on my show, you know. Uh, Sarah, she may have been, she's very popular. London artist. Yeah, yeah, on the, on the, in the suburbs, but she's okay. good. And look at these cats. Yeah. They they're never so wander, do they? No, they never go at all, they're very good. This is the one that's a bit, a bit more friendly coming out. Here. Oh, oh, good good boy, good, good boy. Oh! Who's good? Um, they're side, they're, oh. ay, 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 ay. <laughs> Mike That's has, naughty. Mike has to groom them with a glove on. We're going to do another video of the grooming, aren't we? Yeah, we're going to do, I love these little legs. Yeah, look at the look little at these feet. these little legs. You're good boy. Good. Go Thank on. you, Mike. Thank you for That's the okay. hammer. That's okay, and I'll catch up with you later. Never have a look in my flat at the way I've hung my, no. I've hung them, I've really hung them so badly, they're all lopsided. No, it's great to see you as always. Oh, hello, good morning. So, um, I am heading to Worthing with Matilda, who's asleep next to me. Um, it's a very early morning for her. And um, we are celebrating her birthday by going down with her cousin, who's also obviously a bulldog, also a bulldog from Marylebone. We're going to meet them in Worthing and have a day in Worthing, which shows I'm... Um, getting older because it was always Brighton um, but in fact I've done Brighton and Worthing is the new Brighton we're just going to go uh, because it's probably going to be one of the last good days uh, in August and we're going to just go along put I'm taking Matilda's stroller because if I do the entire length of the prom she won't be able to keep up um, and Flora her cousin is only three and a half so she can run for miles so I'll take the stroller and we're going to have um, seafood lunch on the front because there's a lovely um, seafood uh, stall where they have um, roll mops and crab and oh, I love I love seafood so we're going to go down there and then head back just a day trip because I'm going to make the most of these three days so right I'm going to meet Susie and Flora in Worthing and we're going to set off it's sunny at the moment it's gorgeous <laughs> Here with my friend Susie. Uh, where's, here's Susie and Flora. And we've come down to celebrate Matilda's birthday. She loves her stroller. And just have a look at the sea. The sea, the tide is out, which is stunning. And we've been on the beach. behind me I mean this is amazing I've I know Worthing really well I have never seen the tide out just stunning we think this might be the last day of the summer really you get a feeling that it is look at 
They're marylebone dogs and they love the seaside, don't they, Fair? They absolutely adore it. Anyone for a cornetto? We, and we've had a crab sandwich. I mean, that's not a euphemism. We actually have had a crab sandwich. <laughs> Look who's come to visit. Look who's come to visit. Hello. Hello. Why are you here? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Is that fuzzy? I think it's fine. I'll turn this off. Um, Philippe came over because we've had a, a few, well, okay, so, we've had a collapse, it's raining Philippe, thank God you brought your Bromley. Yeah. Um, you all hate it when I do sponsored videos. This isn't really a sponsored video that Philippe and I have been working on. It's, well actually it is. Kind of, it's not on your channel. No, it's a promotional video. It has proven to be a complete and utter nightmare, hasn't it? Because it involves me and my mother and friends in Australia. In fact, we might insert a little clip here. I don't know whether... We can, maybe. Well, too bad. Look at Matilda. She's so happy Philippe's here. Philippe, you've got to go through the rain. Yeah, I'll have, be fine. Have you got a message? Me? Mm. A message? For anyone. Oh, uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel. YouTube channel, why did I say it like that? Subscribe to my YouTube channel. I knew he'd do that. <laughs> well, he did ask if I have a message. And what is the YouTube channel? Um, I upload a cover every Friday at around 6 p.m. Might change, but I, a cover of a song, so yeah. I make music. He does make music, and he's had a haircut. I did, yeah. It's, it's still set up, it's bad, it's still bad, but it always takes a few days for it to be okay. Everyone loves your hair. Okay, enough now. You are clever, Amy. This is Amy, the producer, needs no introduction. You will notice Amy's puff sleeves, everybody. Very similar, who can guess where her blouse came from? Because I wear something with a very similar cut the sleeves and the long tag at the back. Let me just show you this, which is absolutely brilliant. There, uh, absolutely brilliant. I mean, Amy doesn't live alone. I live alone. I can never do my zips up. So those long ties are fantastic. Um, I'm going to end the vlog here. Amy has to, so the producer has to set, I'm not, you'd think I'd know how to do this. I have no idea how to actually set my desk up when I come on air. So Amy has to literally spoon feed me. She comes and does this and all then I do is sit down and talk for three and a half hours, which is wonderful. Um, but I'm going to leave the vlog here because we have a show to do. <laughs> <laughs> and um, yeah, and I better crack on because I've been away for three days. So thanks to all of you. Sorry it's a bit bitty this week. Don't forget to. Amy, have you subscribed? Of course. Of course she has. Don't forget long to subscribe. Time. Yes, she's a long time subscriber. And I will see you. There will be a midweek vlog on Wednesday. See you then. Bye. I'm walking here the knee and